Linda, how you doing? What's the word? We're feeling blessed. How about you? You doing good? What else too? What's up, happy people? How y'all doing out there? It's your girls with three happy plays. And today we have a reaction video. Yes. So much going on and we are not happy to react mm -hmm. or to report this at no. all. No. I don't know if you guys have heard, but Tamar Braxton is in need of some prayers. Yes. Yes. Thoughts and yes. prayers right now. Send it out right now to Tamar Braxton and the yes. entire Braxton family. 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 Yes. Real talk. Now, if you guys are confused about where we're coming from right now, then you guys want to listen. Watch this video to the end because yes. we have a lot to a talk lot. about. But before we get into it, you guys, you already know what to do. Mm -hmm. Like, comment. Share this video with everybody and subscribe. Join the Happy People fam. Gang, gang, gang. And you guys know we always coming through with the yes. coldest water bottle with my name on it. Say yes. my name. Say my name. And get yours in the link below. Description box. Check it out. Yes. Oh my gosh, you guys, speaking of the coldest water, let me take a sip too, Ooh, mama, because yes. I am hot at Ooh. all this news I have heard. It is right. a mess. It's, it's, it's my oldest granddaughter. It's a mess. It's a mess. It's a mess. I wasn't, no, that was Jada. Jada. It's, it's a mess. A, it's, it's a, a mess. mess. It's a you mess. You guys, so if you haven't heard, oh my gosh, again, we are just sitting we trying to chill and watch Netflix. Netflix and chill. Uh -huh. And lo and behold, we mind our own business. And we hear Tamar Braxton has been hospitalized. Mm -hmm. yes. Mm -hmm. yes. And we're like, what? Tamar? Tamar's Tamar been Braxton. hospitalized? No way. So we like, oh, wait, wait, wait. We got to Google. We got to YouTube. We got to do something. What's going on? Right. Well, we did. And apparently, they are saying that it's alleged suicide, suicide attempt. Craziness. Yes. So Ain't that crazy? It's super crazy. Yeah. So, Nay, what happened? So, we looked it up. We found some stuff. And we found some things. So, let's start off with telling the people what the report was about how Tamar ended up in the hospital. And then we'll kind of rewind some days and kind of figure out what kind yeah, of maybe yeah. potentially Pot led up to, to this. That, yeah. Y'all, yeah. so supposedly this was a suicide attempt, uh -huh. like, like she said. And what happened was they found that she yeah. had alcohol in her system along with some other prescription pills. Whew. Uh, and by some, I mean quite a few prescription pills. Wow. So that's why they are calling this a suicide attempt. Yeah. Now, we did some digging because we had to know what was going on. Yeah, okay? like what was in Tamar's sight? We don't think of, when you think of Tamar Braxton, no. you don't think of somebody who's going to attempt to, to, to take their right. own life. No, no. Um, And so yeah. apparently her boyfriend... It's okay, Mama. Apparently, apparently, her boyfriend David is the one. So they were in the Ritz Carlton Hotel, you guys. Yes. And so he came to the hotel room and found Tamar unresponsive. Awesome. Yeah. So he calls nine one one, gets her rushed to the hospital. Mm -hmm. And so we we're like, okay, what happened? Because this is out of Tamar Braxton's character, right? right? Completely. I mean, I would just never imagine so, Tamar right? Braxton doing anything like this yes. at all. So, Shanae, you did a little bit digging. We mm -hmm. did some digging, y'all. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, so y'all know um, she has a television series on We TV coming out, and they released the trailer. Mm -hmm. Yes. Check that out right now. Mm -hmm. It's a tape. What makes this project different? <laughs> what? what? Everything. All these cameras. This is not like the other shows that you've done. Yeah, Mars had to dump there. I need you to commit to them. I lost my dream. This time. is our moment for you to get back in the driver's seat of your life. My goal is to win, and I'm not going to stop. So I'm conscious. We're going to go into the battleground of your soul. 
<laughs> it's been so long since I've done an album. I am afraid. Logan! I'm responsible for only one person, that's Logan and myself. I told you, I don't want Vince walking through my house again. What's your opinion about framework? It's in every series. I'm not playing Russian roulette with my life anymore. Period. Nope, oh, that's it for me. I'm out. I can't. Uh uh. Where are being asked to leave the premises? I'm not fighting my sister. I'm not fighting nobody. What's that? Yeah, you need to go home. Hey, hey. Same OT. Yes. Okay. So this trailer, obviously, what is the show even about? Right. They got her all behind the scenes. They got her character looking like out of whack. Like mm -hmm. they portraying her just as, drama filled. Drama filled. They are portraying her in a Dip horrible light. Yeah, hot emotional. And, yeah, fighting with the producers. Yes, diva. Just the extra diva, and mm -hmm. that's kind of you know how she was kind of portrayed right. yeah. in the family. Braxton values. Yes. yes. Well, it turns out about two weeks ago, y'all, she wrote We TV and let them know about themselves, basically saying, Y'all have ruined my whole family. Y'all have ruined me. Y'all mm -hmm. have basically made me suicidal. Mm. Um, she she dropped a whole load of tea on them, but she yeah. was trying to get out of her contract, contract mm -hmm. with them. And I will say, y'all, and this is something we all are guilty of. We are sold on the drama. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That is so true. We are sold on the dramas, and that's why they are pushing it, and that's exactly. why they do it, and they doing it way too much in the black community, and I just thought that's I'd That's what Tamar had been doing in her social media recently. Yes, Tamar. She's been talking about it. She's been talking about the entertainment business yeah. and kind of how they're being used as puppete as puppets. Right. And these producers and these networks are puppeteers, and they're just perpetuating an image of mm -hmm. just drama. Yes. And what she thought was going to be an excellent opportunity to show mm -hmm. a strong black yeah. family turned yeah. out to be just drama, drama. feel and really taking a real true toll on their and family. If y'all kept up with Tamar, y'all will know she has been trying to work on herself. Yes. yes. She's been trying to be a better person. And she has seen mm -hmm. to be the person that she's trying to become. Right. You know? yeah. She is really trying to flip. So then when yeah. her character just gets completely just shown like right. that, right. that's then, gotta be hard. There's like, a clip of them showing her saying same old T. You mm -hmm. know, it's like she's just the same old person that she used to be mm -hmm. when, you know, she's been trying to change. You it's know? someone's personal life, their family, right. their character, like I, I see why she changed her Twitter name to Tamar Slave Braxton. Yes. Mm -hmm. And before that, she had uh, Tamar the Thug, Thug Braxton. Braxton. And the Thug reference was for some Trump said. Well, that's just what I got from the Thug reference was, y'all know Trump tweets. Mm-hmm. That's all. There's enough saying yeah, Trump yeah, tweets. Yeah. That's he tweets, y'all. He right. mentioned the stuff about the protesters and the thugs and the rioters right. and whatever. So I kind of tied that to that because if y'all know, Tamar it has tweeted about all of the stuff going mm -hmm. on in the world right now, especially right. in the black community. So for me, that tied into that. As right. a matter of fact, she's been so involved with this movement mm -hmm. since the George, George Floyd, Floyd. Yeah. passing. She has been making tweets mm -hmm. such as, you know, things are getting really real out here. Right. Then you got people, oh you got journalists, God. and right. you got clout seekers taking what she's saying and just reaching, and just honey. reaching right. and Reach. creating a story out of, you know, something way out of context. She said the word real, real. so it had to do with and the they just really? ran with that word. They tied it to the recent announcement tabloid of Tamara Lori. Tabloid after mm -hmm. news. Right. And they tied it to the recent um, news of Tamara Mari leaving. announcing that she's leaving yeah, the, real. the real. And she's like, honey, I ain't even, no. She's I'm not like, even that person. Ain't right. nobody got time. It's too much going on in the world. Mm -hmm. Right. Basically, yeah. lock up Breonna Taylor's uh, murderers. But, uh, right. Tamar actually um, had some tweets about depression. Yeah, she yeah. retreated someone who depression. Let me, she retreated someone who was talking about depression, y'all. Mm -hmm. And when someone retreats, it does not mean that that's their life story. 
However, with the current situation, it does make a lot of sense. Yeah. yeah. Any form of depression is no joke. It definitely needs to be taken more seriously. Serious. She mm-hmm. reposted that with the amen. With yeah. the amen. So, you guys, this is pretty darn serious. Now, they're saying alleged suicide attempt. Was it a suicide attempt? And my heart of hearts, just to tame all I know... I don't want to believe that it was. You don't want to believe but it. It's, but everything is possible. All I know is that Sister Girl and her family needs tons of prayer and positive yeah, energy definitely. and vibes. Because right now, it's obviously what I do know is that she is have, she's in a difficult time in her life right now. Yes. That Even I all do of know. the stuff going on in the black community, it does do something to you. Like you... You have to take days it for does. your mental. Like it is so hard yeah. to see the stuff, and we, you know, we care so, so much, much about. And it's yeah. obvious, obvious that Tamar does care. Right. And you know what, Tamar, she is a wonderful woman doing mm-hmm. big things, and I am so happy that she has yeah. survived this roadblock this summer, whatever you want to call it. Yeah. She has gotten past it. I am so glad she is here today because. She does make a difference, and she will continue to make a difference, and I believe in her, and I think she just wants people to see what, you know, who she really is, because I see who she really is. Mm -hmm. People are so quick to just look at the bad and and judge and, like, to make a dollar. Right. But going back to what y'all said about what's going on, especially with the black community, and it really does take a toll on you because for the most part, we have to get up, go to work every day like nothing is happening to us. And I I confess myself, I don't like the whole quarantine situation, but I'm kind of glad yeah in the you know these situations that i'm at home yeah there's been times i'm on my computer working and bust out crying and i'm just so glad that i'm just at home Home, you know to be able to just grieve but it does it takes a toll on you and Mm -hmm. i can i can testify this is her whole life she's already said she's basically a slave to this Mm -hmm. like this is her life now they've created an image for her and for all of that, you know how much that takes from someone. Yeah. And then she's complaining on Twitter about pay. And mm-hmm. y'all know there's been a lot of talk in the well, if y'all don't know now, y'all know. There's a lot of talk in the black community where as black actors and actresses, including Viola Davis, mm-hmm. and I threw her name out there because she should be highly paid. Pay. Mm-hmm. But I digress. Um, not getting mm-hmm. a pay. She put on Twitter, are we gonna talk about pay? I 100% wrote the theme song, Where's the Coin? Our show is on Netflix, Where's the Coin? Mm -hmm. 10 years on the air, we make 75% less than the Kardashian, and how come there are no villains on Mm -hmm. that show? You have just the pressures that come with the status of who you are Mm -hmm. as a person in your profession and in your fame. And then you have what's going on, the racial injustices, in the middle of this pandemic, that can take a toll on anybody. anybody. So I just think that, and just the rumors and the speculation with her old show, I just think, you know what, it might have been a weak moment for Tamar, and yeah. it, it it was an accident nonetheless that we, we wish did not happen. Mm-hmm. But I pray that she just gets total recovery yeah. and healing inside and out honestly she needs a you know emotional heart mental yeah. healing you know as well as a physical recovery mm-hmm. as well so tamar we love you girl we are with you hunty yes, we are tamar. praying for you we are thinking about you we're sending all kind of positive vibes to you and to your family yes. you will get through it we are so glad the so good yes. lord um um you're in the hospital recovering and yes. that this this story could have been a lot worse. Yes. And we are mm-hmm. thankful to the Lord that it was yes. not the other story ending. Right. Your yes. story continues going on, girl. And we believe that you're going to recover and you're going to continue to fight another day. day. Yes. So 
Um, yeah, I'm. Y'all got anything else? Any yeah, last? I'm gonna say just one last thing, and this is supposedly came out. I don't know how true it is, but y'all supposedly she sent a, a basically a suicide threat to her families that started out as a tweet that she never did post to Twitter that she just screenshot and sent to her family, and it reads, "I am a slave." I do not own my life. Mm. My stories, my pictures, my thoughts are beliefs. I've asked my master to free me. I'm threatened and punished for it. Mm. The only way I see out is death. I will choose wow. that before I continue to love like this. Please help me. Wow. Now, this is an alleged post that she was going to send out. Yeah. It's alleged, you guys. We don't, know, we don't know if it, if it if did right. really was that. You know what I'm saying? We don't know. But if this mm -hmm. is true, you guys, again, that just shows Ooh. what kind of state that she's, she's in. in. And she needs a lot of love, a lot of prayer, and a lot of support right now, you guys. Mm -hmm. Um... Anything else you got to say, Mom? Yeah. I, this message is for you directly, Tamar. Oh. Honey, we love you. Mm -hmm. I love you dearly. You are an awesome person. You are a beautiful person inside and beautiful. out. Yes. And this, I want you to know, honey, we need you here. Yes. And I forget your son's name, but baby, he needs you too. Yes. Okay. But just remember that. But I love you. And I'm, I support you 100,000%. Mm -hmm. Yes. I I I first I second that third that amen all of that we need you here your family your 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 um, yes. loved ones your son um, everyone everyone needs you here your light is to shine and right. you, I don't believe your light light is dim yet yeah, yeah, yeah so. All right, well, guys, this was a diff di very different video yep. from you guys. But yeah. anytime we hear something like this, we want to share it with you guys just so that you can get some good information that's not coming. You don't have that's to not digging. Right. And it's not messy. You know, we're not coming from a messy, messy. place and we're right. not trying to perpetuate gossip. Right. But we really just, well, we really, we were just stunned by this news. <laughs> we were just shocked by this news and really just wanted to to express our thoughts about it and and send out our prayer. All right. So you guys know what to do. Go ahead and like, comment and subscribe, but more importantly, don't forget to hit that notification, notification.